Maybe. Right now, time to see what's clicking in Cleveland. For that, we bring in our digital anchor, Stephanie Haney. Hi, Steph. Hi there, Jay. You know, if these allegations are true, this first one is shocking because there are a lot of former Cleveland Cavaliers accused of stealing almost $4 million from their NBA insurance plans. Not a Cavalier, but Terrence Williams is accused of being the ringleader and recruited 17 other players to get paid out on fake insurance claims. Five of them, former Cavs, including Jamario Moon, Shannon Brown, Darius Miles, Sebastian Telfair, and Milt Palacio. That sixth player, Reuben Patterson, didn't play for the Cavs, but he's from Cleveland. And today they're all facing federal charges. Also today, Shelly Meyer, who is married to Urban Meyer, has posted online for the first time since that video came out, and she says this is her last tweet ever. She writes that she's leaving the platform because of the hate, vitriol, and slander. This is after she liked tweets saying that her husband doesn't deserve her, following that video coming out of him getting very close with another woman. Now, Urban has apologized, and Shelly wrote that we all make mistakes and we are all sinners. All right, now let's get to a bit of good news from our weekly It's All Good News show. This is Stephanie Metzger and Patrick Lawrence, who finally got married on August 25th, almost a full year after their original plans. They had a gorgeous private ceremony in Greece, and when they came back home to make it legal, they had a short ceremony at University City Heights City Hall, where the mayor declared their official wedding day of September 24th, 2021, as Stephanie Metzger and Patrick <laughs> Lawrence Day in the Whoa. city. Now, for those of you who may not know at home, Stephanie used to work with us here, so I saw this on her page and I asked her, how do they do this? How yeah. is, is this a thing? And it is a thing in University Heights. Everyone can do this on your wedding date. Just in University Heights? Just in University Heights because there's only 13,000 people that live there, so they have a little extra space to make it special for if people. If you're an entrepreneur, cool. get an event center in, in University Heights mm -hmm. because then you're... Patrons can have their own day. Yeah, C congratulations Genius. to the happy new couple. Uh, and by the way, beautiful pictures. Yeah. Stephanie, when and where can people see the full Good News show? Because oh. that's uplifting. It really is. It's such a great time. And it comes out every Wednesday at 1 p.m. on the WKYC YouTube page. And we would love to feature your good news. You can share it with us using the hashtag GoodNewsCLE through the WKYC app as well, or by text or email. And we would really love for you to keep that good news coming.